I'm gonna keep this pretty short, sweet, and simple. You're gonna need a few tools, which will be the box opener, some bubble wrap, and then you also have some packing tape as well. So the first step is you're gonna cut each of these top flaps off. Now I'm gonna admit something to you all. I've already done this step, but I'll give you a quick simulation of what it'll look like. <laughs> that one's done. Uh, that one's done. Uh, that one. Uh, that one. Boom. Pretty self-explanatory. We're just cutting the top flaps off of the box. For the next step, you want to make sure that you cover your area so that it's clean. This table is very dirty underneath. You don't want to mess up your paintings. So the very first step is going to be to take your paint, your roll actually. I like to put the smooth side facing up. And there is a full smooth side facing up. And then you take one of your flaps from the box, place it right there. Boom, you take Michelle Obama or your painter. And that roll you just took, all we're going to do is just make sure that this bad boy is covered. You might be saying to yourself, okay, Khalil, but it's still not sealed. Well, the video isn't finished. Let me show you. And to seal off the sides, we're going to just take these flaps here, fold them over, tape them down with some packing tape. So here we are. We've got the whole thing packed, sealed, not going anywhere. And uh, I'm obviously not very good at packing, but neither are you because you're looking for my video right now. And I also hope to get better um, and pack a lot more things from selling a lot of merchandise from my incredibly popular YouTube channel. Okay, we got them all packed up together, two in each one. Now we're going to get them in the box for a fitting test. I honestly hope you've done this fitting test prior to, to make sure you had a size appropriate box. But with the packing material, we're gonna make sure, boom, it goes in there nice and flush. Let me show you. Yes, yes, excellente. But now here comes the pro tip. If you're ready for all of that, we're gonna take our garbage bag. So you probably guessed it for this next bit. We're gonna take our box opener and we're gonna cut this down to make this to a smaller box. Hopefully you took your painting out and you did slice up your painting, but now we're just gonna fold these all in. Like so. It doesn't have to be perfect. Again, we're doing this the cheapest way possible. Now we tape. And there we have it, our newly downsized box. Let's take it to FedEx because they're the cheapest for this type of stuff. We are here at FedEx by choice at this time. Always price check, look around to see what's the best price and make sure before you ship it off, everything is sealed, sealed. Yes, this is a bit of a crude design, but we're talking about the cheapest possible shipping method for paintings, which can vary in size. And this will always do the job if you have the right size box.